They never kill nobody yet. They never kill nobody yet. Why them have to take me to a nephew? Me ain't instead nephew them. Welcome back to My View TV, the people's platform the home of undiluted news, reviews, updates, and your daily dose of entertainment. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. Leave us a comment, like, share, and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple me. Why go on, people? Open body in okay. Open body in all right. You know, so once gunshot beat and people the on the ground lie down, me I go find it and make you know exactly what I go on. Guess which part there now, people? Right down at Westmoreland, my gun. So here what I go on down at Westmoreland now. The Westmoreland police are probing last night shooting death of two men at a bar in Big Bridge, Westmoreland. Jamario Fenton, age 24, and Henry Thompson, age 35, both of Big Bridge in the parish, were shot dead shortly after 9.15 p.m. The men were among patrons at a bar when two men rode up on motorcycle and opened fire, hitting them multiple times before speeding away. I will land there. Not even buckle people I'm gonna fling off for them because the people about duck for cover and I try to save them own life. But them family member come out and say, yo, them are a good man, them are a bad man. People are not me say so. I will them family say, I will make you hate for yourself. They never kill nobody yet. They never kill nobody yet. Why them have to take me to a nephew? Me ain't instead nephew them. You know what I'm Especially what we call it, um, nippers. I'm a, I'm a father of favorite grand, grand pitney. My father of great grand pitney. And my first one for my father of great granny. I know they take him my life. They take him my life in Augusta because a man come here, come threaten my nephew in Augusta. So you say you never get threatened. Did you, did you report that to the police? No one talked to no police? No, we can't anything? take care of you. No. We mm -hmm. can't take care of you. But it happened now. It happened now. Mm -hmm. It happened now. I don't know him. No. I don't know him. No. Because he might tell you if we hide it. When, when they might come with bike, and we are going to hide, they hide, we hide the pitney them. Yeah, see, so see, then come and kill him. So then so, come and so kill him. None of them did not take the threat serious. We never take the threat serious. But them are not wrong doer. Them are not wrong doer. You know, see it? Mm -hmm. I don't know what they are, but for me. No, oh, actually, you don't know any man. No, I'll go say no. You know, I'll go say. The government will take off. Who are they buying them off the road? If government take off, who will I buy? If government will leg on the people them on the road, they kill off the people them. So, you don't hear the bike and you don't hear the shot. Yeah. I work, I work, me there, you know. Because I call. Yeah. If one, when you're Henry, I call. I'm going to help me cut up some steel and say, but, you know, say, Uncle, you know, sell this morning, last time I got party, I'm not feel too, I no strength in me. Gas, he probably went go, he go wash his face. Mm -hmm. I'm say, all right, boss. All right, I'll me, 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 me go down there. When I don't have work, I used to then shot me too, nephew. See, when I park, I me, me look at my bicycle. So I park, I look at my bicycle. So when I don't live there. So when I don't live there, Jay, I don't say I don't live there. And the other one live right here, so. You know, see it. Why don't you take me too, nephew, and I left in the morning. A morning, bar. So how do you feel? And then know say I want revenge country we live in. Everybody know the government knows say I want revenge country we live in. You know, see it? Yeah, and when we go down, defile the body, and we come out in the bus. You know what I mean? And we come out at the man mouth. And we don't know where they eat. And the government will put a stop down at Westmoreland. You know, see it? The government will put a stop down at Westmoreland. And seize all the bike them. And license bike them. Find them. Find them, find them. A two, a three guys, you know. You know? Three guns where they shoot, you know. One little 17 year old girl, oh, my name is nice again. No. Almost four years ago, no. nine shot, then give me no, then give her in her head. No. I know I two more. Two more. From this one yard. From this one yard. You know, see, two more. One girl and two and two one, no man. And we, look, we are peaceful people. I plan me, I plan for my birthday with the youth, them tomorrow and go to church, you know, but I celebrate my birthday at church tomorrow, you know. 
You know, see, that's what happened, you know. Me, I said to myself, I wonder if nothing's gonna happen. I wonder if nothing's gonna happen. You know, see. It. You understand. I wanna what you say, I said, we love the church. We got Wesley and Holy Church and Nile. You know, see. It. I wish I to my birthday, you know, I got to celebrate my birthday at church tomorrow. You know, see, then why they, why they have to do my family, me, me too, never like that. Eh? Somebody link up daddy for me there and tell him, say, me have a message for him. Tell him, say, me tap him all in. Yes, tell him, tap him all in right now. Link up the people of the community and the people that would sit down in the bar. Ask them where they're involved in her. You understand? Just ask the people them where they're involved in her. You don't send a bag of white shot, never fire. No bag of wild shot never fire. The man them know exactly how them come for. Get them target and them gun. So ask the people them where they mix up in a. You probably don't know. And then again, sometimes I know how to turn a blind IT because I'm a family member. Said what I said and I mean what I said and I not take him back. And for the people that work ask, yes, there's a picture of them can show the two of them lay down on the ground. Yeah, man, me have it. Just forward pan the ends and come come ask it. Then again, the people them pan the ends don't get it already. Cause so we operate pan this platform here. Yeah. Okay? Me can move over to the news now. What you are going now, people? Me go link up Peter Champagne, not Peter Bog Joe's. Defense attorney, Queen's Counsel Peter Champagne is supporting the utilization of mandatory minimum sentence for firearm offenses. But he's calling for judges to be under the discretion to step outside the mandate in exceptional circumstances. I walk him out. Yes, people, I walk him out. But anyway, maybe I could hear him officer. As counsel, plural, we recognize, and we may be unpopular for that, uh, because the general perception, it seems, is that there is some hesitancy and disagreement in terms of mandatory minimum sentences insofar as this bill is concerned. However, having said that, it is our considered view here, as constituted, that the proposal in terms of the mandatory minimum is something that we would fully endorse. While we recognize the objects and reasons in terms of the bill, we would humbly pray that this honorable committee gives consideration to what I would describe, what we would describe as exceptional circumstances. Ever so often, ever so often, there are exceptional circumstances. So we'd ask that consideration be given to that because although the situation is one that doesn't happen regularly, the fact of the matter is that it happens. 40 to 50 percent or more of the cases that come before those courts are instances where the police is asserting that an illegal firearm was taken from the waistband of an accused. The numbers are large. And what we have found, Mr. Chairman, is that but for in instances where Indicom is involved, where they embark on some testing in terms of DNA swabbing of the weapon recovered, but for that and the result thereof, there would have been many a persons serving periods of incarceration wherein the evidence would not support it or did not support it.